Hey angels, welcome back to Unique Mystery. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Um, this is a topic that has been called for me to give some advice on. And this topic is about somebody who's constantly being called ugly. This brings this person's self-esteem down. They feel that it's true just because one person has told them that they're ugly. So they actually believe that it's true. And it's like bringing their self-esteem down. As they say, they did not have much self-esteem in the first place, but the little bit they had... This is actually bringing it all the way down because they keep being told by different people that they are ugly. So first of all, you know, I'm going to give my advice on this topic because this is my advice. And as I always say, I believe that I give great advice, so I have no problem with giving advice because also that's what I love to do I love giving advice and I love helping people the best way that I know how so let's let's talk about this you are being called ugly not just by one person but by numerous of people and because you will be you're being called ugly by numerous of people you are believing it you're taking it in it has taken your self-esteem way down and it's hard for you to focus and it's hard for you to think that you're worthy or you don't think that you're beautiful you don't think that you're pretty you don't think that you're handsome whatever that case may be without you know telling who this person is now, okay, this doesn't even, this doesn't even, what's the word I'm trying to say here? Okay, let's put it like this. Just because someone is calling you ugly, you do not have to believe them. Just because more than one person calls you ugly, you do not have to believe them, okay? A plenty of people may call you ugly. Does that mean that they know what they're talking about? No, that doesn't mean that they know what they're talking about. That doesn't mean that you're ugly because they called you ugly. Okay, people will call people names sometimes because of numerous of reasons maybe because they're mad maybe because they just don't like you for whatever reason maybe for no reason that they don't like you or maybe they're even jealous okay so there are plenty of reasons why someone will say something negative about you most of the time they're saying something negative about you and it points back to themselves okay so if they're telling you something negative this has to do with a lot of times how they feel about themselves and when somebody feel bad about themselves or if they feel negative about themselves they tend to try to make other people feel bad about themselves and bring other people down so they can feel low about themselves because if you ever heard that saying called misery loves company well that's true a lot of misery miserable people they love company so that means if they're ugly well not if they're ugly okay let me put that, let me take that back if they feel ugly if they think that they're ugly then they're miserable because that's how they feel about themselves so they want to bring the next person down and they want to make you feel like you're ugly if that's how they feel 
you know they'll just feel better if they can make somebody else feel the same way they feel okay so that's another reason why every time somebody says something negative to you you don't have to believe it okay if somebody is constantly calling you ugly that person could be jealous of you that person could you know want something that you have that person could feel so down about themselves they know or they feel that they're ugly inside or out and they just want you to feel the same okay so you don't necessarily have to believe well I'm not gonna say necessarily just don't believe everything that you're told okay because there are plenty plenty proven facts in the world that a lot of times when you're told something it's not true okay so you know that's my advice and also I want to say this this stuff starts with you first of all it all starts with how you feel about yourself it takes you to feel good about yourself before you're gonna be able to take bad criticism from other people so if you feel good about yourself if you feel that you're beautiful if you feel that you're handsome then you do not need somebody else to tell you that you're beautiful that you're handsome okay if they tell you that just you know makes you know what you feel is true but if they don't tell you that doesn't necessarily mean that it's not true because you already feel that way about yourself so you don't need somebody else to tell you so you have to work with yourself first before you will be able to know the difference now if you work with yourself and you're able to start feeling good about your own self then it will not matter what the next person tell you like a hundred people can tell you that you're ugly a hundred people can tell you that you're stupid but if you know that you're smart and if you know that you're beautiful if you know that you're handsome then what those hundred people say will not even phase you because you know the truth and at the end of the day as long as you know it then that's all you need to confirm it if you know something about yourself that's the only person that you need to confirm that it is true that it is real you don't need other people to confirm it for you if they do then that's great whatever but if they don't who cares you don't need that so you have to start with yourself and just work on yourself know that you're beautiful know that you are handsome know that you are smart know that you are worthy okay then other people will know the same so you have to represent yourself on the way you feel about yourself okay and then once you do that like I said a thousand people can come somewhere and tell you oh you're ugly oh you're stupid but you're not gonna believe it because you yourself you know the truth so that's my advice to you the first thing you need to do is work on yourself be happy with who you are you do not have to look like everybody else to be beautiful because we all don't look alike and we're all different in certain ways we all have our own unique beauty and ways of looking so because you don't look like the next person definitely does not mean that you're not beautiful so don't compare yourself to others find your beauty know that you are beautiful know that you are handsome know that you are smart know that you are worthy and go with that
then once you know that no matter what a person or persons say to you about it you know it's not true because you've already confirmed it yourself and that's the only one who needs to confirm what you are is yourself okay so I hope that um, everybody enjoyed this topic and everybody likes my advice so everybody out there who needs some advice definitely leave in the comments a topic and I will definitely you know give some advice on that topic so I am definitely taking topics right now because I give great advice and I'm just gonna give you the advice my way okay so if you want advice my way then like I said just leave some topics for me to cover in the comment section and I will definitely get to it so thanks so much angels for watching and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video bye